Got another practical skills walkthrough video here. So this one is about qualitative analysis. And as always, the link to the questions in the description of the video if you wanted to try it first. Okay, so quite a simple question this one. So we've got a sample of ammonium bromide. There's the formula. The cation in here is the ammonium ion, NH4+, and the anion is the Br- ion. So we'll do the test for the ammonium ion first. So the way this one works is you warm it with aqueous hydroxide ion. So normally you would use sodium hydroxide solution for that. You would hold some damp red litmus paper at the mouth of the test tube and you would test the gas that's coming off the reaction. And if the ion in the tube is the ammonium ion, it will liberate ammonia, which will turn this red litmus paper blue. So there's the equation for that reaction and there's the ammonia gas that's turning the litmus blue. So moving on to the test for the bromide ion. Now at the start of the question we were told that it was ammonium bromide so we know that it's a bromide ion present. So we don't really need to add the um, nitric acid to remove any suspected carbonate ions. We're assuming it's just pure ammonium bromide here. So the first thing you would do is add silver nitrate solution and the presence of the bromide ion will generate a cream precipitate of silver bromide. And there's the equation for that precipitation reaction. Now I have checked the mark scheme and they aren't fussed on seeing the extra test for the bromide ion which is the addition of aqueous ammonia. You could confirm that it's a bromide by adding some concentrated aqueous ammonia to that and that would dissolve. But like I say, that's not actually required for this particular question. 